All over the forest, dinosaur males are out to impress the females. That's the mating call of a she-rex you hear. This guy heard it too, and rushed right over. With a gift, of course. With those puny little arms of his, he couldn't wrap it up. But so what? He's snacking at his own risk. If the female doesn't like the looks of his present, or anything else about him, she could attack. It's showtime. That's her. Better hope you don't have carcass breath, my man. You don't want to offend a five-ton female. So far, so good. They're chatting, at least. And if buckets of drool mean anything, she uh, seems to appreciate his taste. Okay, let's just give her some space. She's considering his gift, but at any moment, she could turn on the male. Phew! As long as she's devouring the Triceratops, the male T-Rex is safe from her jaws. T-Rex couples usually stay together for a few days. During that time, the female is always in charge because she's bigger and stronger than the male. Three days later, and the female is getting bored with her mate. Sound kind of rude? Well, there's no time for hurt feelings. Now that their picnic is just about, uh, picked clean, it's time for the female to think about hunting. That means politely asking her mate to get lost. If the male sticks around, he might compete with her for prey. Now he could try and stand his ground, but he's smaller, he's weaker, and if he doesn't move soon, he's breakfast. So much for the good times.